biblical Christian worldview. What does that mean? Well, Paul writes to the uh, Romans and he says, Therefore I urge you, brothers and sisters, in view of God's mercy, to offer your bodies as a living sacrifice, holy and pleasing to God. This is your true and proper worship. He says, do not conform to the pattern of this world, but be transformed by the renewing of your mind. Then you'll be able to test and approve what God's will is, his good, pleasing, and perfect will. Now, Jesus says to love the Lord your God with all your heart and all your mind, all your soul, all your strength. We're very good at loving God with all our heart, but we often fall short when it comes to loving Him with all our minds. In this section, we're discussing a biblical Christian worldview.